Palms, Future Warrior, Guitar Tabs, and Guitar Lesson. I'll play all the different parts right at the beginning. After that, I'll go back through and give the full explanation. Please hit that subscribe button. It's the best way to let me know that you like this video and want to see more stuff by Palms. And now, let's give it a try. Okay, so for starters, we're going to be in a drop D tuning here, and some really interesting uh, chords going on here. This is based mostly in like an F sharp suspended kind of vibe, and basically we're going to, for this intro, pick through uh, kind of a power chord shape here. Now that we're in the drop D, you know, we've got our D, A, D, G, B, E, and we're just going to pick through that low D on the 4 to 4A, four low D 4 to the middle four on the D. And that's kind of like the, the picking that we're going to be looking for in our, you know, various chord changes here for like the bass notes, that type of deal. And then everything after that uh, is kind of going to shift and vary. Um, initially, we just kind of run through this three times where we do like a couple of open B strings to the six on the G. So we're kind of making this shape here, leaving the, you know, the open strings at the bottom here. So we do something like right, and we do that about three times. And then after the third time, we shift down now to this E. All right. And it's same type of deal there where we'll hit like the, the low two, the two on the A back to the low two to the two on the middle D. All right. And this is kind of based around like an E chord. Now we're just kind of do a little scale up through it where we do the open B. 2 to 1 on the G to the 2D. Right, and then we kind of go like we're going to repeat it, but we go to our F sharp at the 4s, at the do our little bit there, the 4, 4, 4, 4. But now we, we're we going to change the ending. Um, in this initial section, we do a couple of open high E's to the 7 on the B. All right, and after that one, uh, we do our picking through the F sharp, set the four. A couple of open Bs back to the six, kind of like we did in the initial section. All right, pick through the fours again. 
and now we kind of do like a little scaling down into that E section where we do the open B to the 6G, then we drop down and do the 2, 1G to 2D. All right, come on up, hit a low two on the D there for that E. And then we kind of just wrap it up through that scale that we, we do in the E section, the open B, 2, 1, G, 2, D. And once the verse gets going, uh, we basically just kind of take those two initial sections and just repeat them. Okay, we do our picking through the fours with a couple open Bs to that 6G, and we, we do that three times. And then we finish it with our dropping down to the twos. Pick up through it with that open B, 2, 1, G, 2, E on the D. All right, and we just do that whole thing twice for the verse. For this pre-chorus section, uh, real similar vibes to what we've been doing. All right, we got our, you know, picking through the fours. But now we add this new little wrinkle here where it's uh, the finishing part is dropping down, hit a couple fours on the high E to open E. So basically we're just going to bar all the fours here and then just lift off for that open E. All right, kind of do the same thing, but just finish it by doing the couple fours on the B to open B. All right, come right back to the fours, pick through them. And then we drop down and do our little E scale. Land on the twos, pick through those. All right, and just repeat that whole thing twice as the pre-chorus. For the chorus, just coming off to some big, uh, you know, overdriven power chords. And starting with those uh, F-sharp power chords here at the, just the fours on the DAD, it's just a one, two, and then we add this little bit where we do a back and forth on the four, six, four, six of the G. All right, just hang it on those fours for a couple more strums. And then we hit one and then drop right down to the twos for the E, strum those out for a few. All right, strum it again, come off to the open low D power chord. Hang out there for one more. And then we just uh, wrap it up by hitting these D flat power chords at the four A six on the D and G there. It's just bang, bang. For the bridge, kind of chills out a little bit. We just do this little like low single string uh, scale thing. Uh, just hit the fourth fret on the low D. Hold it a moment there. And then we hit it again, come up to a couple sevens. Okay, down to six. And then we do five, four on the A. Okay, repeat that twice. And after that, we just come off to a couple of really big uh, low D power chord strums and then just pick an open A, open D. All right, and basically we repeat that eight times and then it kind of throws in a little curve where it does the couple open strums again. But now it does open D to four D. And you can play around with that for a little bit too. For the ending, little low string single line here, we do a couple fours on the low D, hold it, hit a couple more. Okay, hit it and slide it down to two. Okay, up to six. And then just come off to some open, like two open low power chords here. And we just keep strumming that out all the way till the end.